Hey everyone, welcome back for some more Sly 2 Band of Thieves. And in this episode, we're going to do the last mission for something else. So, let's begin by getting to our job. Which is way over there, so... Guess we can begin by pickpocketing. I don't know why I just don't do this outside of recording, but I'll learn someday. Watch out for the spotlight. Thank you for your bronze medal. Now you can die by falling. Okay, to get up there. I gotta say, these guards give up really easily, don't they? Alright. I wonder if I can make it. I... Nope. Dang it. That's okay. We can do it again. Oh, that didn't help any better. Alright. Let's try again. But this time let's just go this way. And I still can't get up there. What the crap? Die already. Okay, here we go, finally. After three minutes of just trying to get up here, let's begin. Okay, Sly, that's it. The Contessa's giant attack robot. Look, Bentley, with all due respect, it looks an awful lot like a water tower. Don't be fooled. That's what she wants you to think. If we try to free Murray while that thing is operational, why... What, we'll have plenty of fresh drinking water? I'm serious, Sly. Of course. I do owe you one. The lightning rods around the prison are designed to draw lightning strikes away from the water tower. And giant attack robot. Uh-huh, yeah. By turning the wheels on the rod, you should be able to redirect the electrical current away from its ground wire, rendering it useless. Follow the lightning strikes to locate all five rods. Okay, so you want me to break the ground circuit on all these lightning rods so that a bolt will strike and destroy the giant attack robot posing as a water tower. That's an accurate summation. <laughs> Now, one thing to note here. Get clear when the lightning rod starts to glow red. That means a lightning bolt is on the way. What Bentley said. Just watch out when the whole thing starts to glow red. Nice work. That lightning rod is out of commission. Look Cause once it does, it'll shock you. Which is not good. Getting hurt and and possible death is not good at all. I gotta say, that's pretty cool. Red lightning. I don't know, I find that to be odd. Anyway, moving on. Let's get this one. Keep 
turning. Nope. There we go. That's two down. Five to go. Or five. Three. I can't do math. Okay. Alrighty, now to get up there. How do we get up there? Hmm. And what's kind of tough about this mission is they don't give you a waypoint or anything, so you're kind of kind of going blind, if you know what I mean. All right, we'll just go for that one way over there. Oh well. Drop down. Oh, piece of crap. I don't know if you saw, but that's what that's where you get shocked. Come on. There we go. Three down, two to go. Went way over there. Oh, shoot. I think it's better to get on the rooftop. Okay. Oh, shoot. That was close. Whoa, that was really close. Okay. One left. And fall in the water. Perfect. No. Dang it. Hopefully I'll get to keep that fourth one. Please let me keep that fourth one. Thank you. Now it's that one up there, which I'm still wondering how I'm gonna do that. Watch out for that spotlight, because you don't want to get shot. And here we go. Just head up. And look at that. It's a freaking wire. How did I not see this? Uh, with each one, as you can see, it's becoming rapidly quicker, so at best you're only going to get like one turn and then one turn and then you have to run, but 